Information about new Telegram missions was found in the game files, and this new Telegram missions looks pretty interesting in my opinion. According to these leaks, it seems like we're gonna be stealing boats and wagons, as well as catching animals and people, mostly women, which is interesting. And yes, the most important is that these new missions are not for solo players, it seems like they are for bosses, and maybe even for bosses only. Ok, the source of this leak is YouTuber and data miner Rockstar Guides. He found 305 voice lines connected to the Telegram missions in the game files and actually listened to all of them. Link to his video will be in the description, he made a great job, so go check it, but luckily I don't need to listen to all all these 305 voice lines because there is a text file with most of these lines. Test 2 shared link to this file on the GTA forums. So I read these lines and now we're gonna make some analysis. First of all, yes, they are gonna be policy focused. By the way, there is another finding in the game files that Test 2 is sharing. There is a message that says that you must be a policy leader to access Telegram missions. Anyway, let's look at the voice lines. By the way, they all belong to Josiah, Telegram mission NPC. Oh, you by yourself, you ditch your friend. Where are your friends? Hey there, lose your friend along the way. So nice you folks to pay me a visit. Wait, you split up? Where is the rest of your posse? So it's obvious that we're gonna make these missions with our friends. And at this point many viewers started to cry, because Red Dead Online players don't have any friends usually, and that's why we are playing this boring horse game. Anyways, there is also a possibility that these new Telegram missions will be available for posses only. I mean, you will be not able to complete it as a solo player, because there will be multiple objects that you have to deliver. For example, first mission seems to be about delivering wagons, so here are some voice lines. Those are some decent looking wagons. Good job, if all rest of the wagons looks like this, we'll be setting very pretty. Oh, you got the first wagon, good, now keep them coming. I won't ask what happened to the driver. By the way, sorry for terrible voice acting. Anyway, as you can see, in this mission we're probably gonna be stealing multiple wagons and delivering them, so it sounds pretty easy, but probably it will require the whole policy, because there will be many wagons and definitely the payout will be bigger if we will deliver all the wagons. Actually, I have an interesting thought that it might be not a simple wagons, but a war wagons, just like the ones that we saw in the Carmela Bounty mission, but later I will tell you why I do think so. Next mission, or type of mission seems to be about catching someone. Maybe it's gonna be animals, because for example he says, now if you can just track down the last of those rats for me, or that's all the snakes, well done. Next one is, just one more of these whistles still out there, let's finish this. That's fine animal, alright, good work. So it's looking like we're gonna be catching some animals, but it's kinda weird because there is no weasels in Red Dead Online. But who knows, maybe we'll be catching some bandits and it's just how he calls them, by rats and snakes. Anyways, there is a lot of references that we're gonna be catching someone, for example, ok, that's the last of these undesirables, good job. But again, he might be talking about animals here, but what is weird is that he often talks about women for sure, for example, oh, there she is, this lady ain't even female for a drinking man to hold up with. First of all, I have to disagree with this statement, because as Russian proverb says, there is no bad looking women, there is only a lack of vodka. And second, I don't think that he is talking about animals here, so probably we're gonna be catching some bandits. Anyways, the last mission is the most interesting in my opinion, because it's about stealing and delivering some boats, so here are the voice line. Just one more boat to go now. There we go, last one, bring her into dock. Nice walk, you can dock over here. Ok now, just be careful as you dock. I knew you would get those boats for me. Which is interesting is that some boats were added to the game files in December update. I mean, on the 1st of December, Randy Light messaged me about two new boats that he found in the game files. First one is a tug board. It looks like the ones that we are using in this Moonshiner mission. But he mentioned two important differences. First of all, we can drive this board. And second, each time when this board 
board spawns on the map it has different color. The second new board that Randy found looks like this and it has word Guarma in the name of the files. But as video tech told me it's just because Rockstar reused some content from the story mode and just decided not to change the name of the file. Anyway, this board is not drivable and you cannot do anything with this because it's just a decoration. Back in December I decided not to make a video about these findings because there was not much information and I had no idea what this is all about and I just didn't want to make a video like attention huge information Guarma was confirmed by the Rockstar and heists and flying bicycles because I've made similar videos before and I regret this. But anyway now these new bots are making perfect sense so Guarma bot will be just a decoration at the dock to which we have to deliver all these bots and tag bot will be something that we have to steal that's why it's drivable because we have to drive it to deliver to the dock and that's why it has different color when it spawns because we will have to steal multiple such bots. And there's another interesting detail. Tag board files are located in the same folder as the war wagon files. And that's why I said that it's quite possible that we're not gonna be stealing regular wagons but some war wagons in the previous mission. Just think about it, it will be super cool. But again, it might be just a coincidence. In any way, all these new telegram missions looks pretty cool in my opinion. I just hope that there will be some decent rewards this time. But let me know what do you think about these new missions in the comments. And as always, thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, до свидания. Yeah, I decided to end up my videos with this like, subscribe, до свидания. It sounds pretty cool in my opinion.